Okay, so the first thing we'll, we'll try to get into some information on CCNP security exams. So as we already know that CCNP, uh, most all the Cisco certification has been revised. And probably after February 2020, if you are going for CCNP security exams, uh, they will be live from February 24, 2020. So if you want to get CCNP security certified, so basically you have to pass two exams. One is the core exam. Like this is the list of uh, list of exams what you generally have in the CCNP security. Now you have to pass this core exam that is your uh, Cisco security on uh, on core technologies, and you have to pass any one of the co concentration exams. So basically, this concentration exams uh, there is a there's a list of papers here you can see. Now each and every concentration exam focuses on one specific technology. Like if you see this paper, this paper focuses on Cisco Firepower and if you if you want to specialize on Cisco Ice, you can go with this paper. So basically you have to pass any one of these exams for the CCNP to, to earn your CCNP security certification. Now what exactly this core paper covers? Now core paper mainly focuses on uh, testing the candidate skills on the core security infrastructure. Uh, basically the concepts like 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 in the core paper you will be getting into uh, most of the core technologies like uh, network security understanding the different types of network security options like VPNs even uh, uh, understanding the different types of attacks theoretically the triplet concepts the Cisco ICE concepts how you are going to provide the network access authentication and also some kind of uh, programming so like SDN architecture kind of things. Now, additionally, you will also be tested on some cloud security and even uh, content security uh, concepts like WSA, ESA. So basically, whatever the con concentrate concrete exams you have, basically you will uh, see most of the overview or some uh, basic foundations also you'll find inside this core paper. So if you just go to the URL, so basically, if I if I go to this uh, see the security core paper, so you'll find some information like like network security, cloud security, uh, content security concepts like WSA, ESA, and even endpoint endpoint protection and detection like uh, AMP, advanced malware protection and antivirus programs. Basically, on that, uh, even understanding the network access securing by using Cisco Ice for device administration as well as for network access and finally we have some other options like visibility uh, and enforcement now now basically this focuses on uh, some there are some concepts like posture assessment uh, profiling kind of things uh, basically I cannot explain you in one one word here but these are like advanced concepts understanding understanding or detecting the status of the devices or what type of devices the users are using so basically this comes under Cisco eyes Okay, so I'll be f uh, specifically moving on uh, individual papers a little bit more in detail probably next. And if you talk about the con concentration exams or concrete exams, now these exams, uh, like you have to pass any one of these exams here in order to get CCNP certification. Like I have already mentioned that if you want to get your CCNP certification, basically you have to pass this core exam and any one of the concrete exams. Uh, one more thing about the core exam is now this exam uh, is also a prerequisite for your CCIE certification. So if you are planning for CCIE certification after February 2020, so instead of writing a written exam, so now there is no written exam, this core exam will be acting as a prerequisite for, uh, for the CCIE certification. Now this is common for all the CCNP certifications, not only CCNP security here. Now the concrete exams uh, or concentration exams here, basically each uh, paper is focused on specific technology. So you will get your CCNP certification if you pass this too. If you are writing just one paper, uh, apart from that you also get a specialist certification. So which means if you are passing this uh, one paper, you will be getting a specialist certificate like you are specialized or a specialist on Cisco Firepower. 
if you're passing this exam, you are specialized on implementing the Cisco uh, ICE, Identity Service Engine for network access and the uh, device administrations. So basically this is like uh, specialized on uh, email security appliance, like securing the emails and the email related options. Uh, web security, this is for HTTP security or web security, filtering your web traffic. And this paper focuses on VPNs, implementing uh, remote access VPNs. And finally, this paper focuses on the automation uh, programmability options. Now, depending upon your uh, specialization or depending upon your expertise, you can choose any one of the concrete exams to get your CCNP uh, certificate. Uh, along with that, you also get this CCNP, uh, the specialist certificate on uh, specific concrete exams.